Light is a form of energy that can travel through many different substances. Right now, light is coming from the bulb above me and traveling through the air. Light can also travel through glass. And light can travel through water. Light is traveling through any material that you can see through, like this box or this plastic bag. We call any material that light is traveling through its medium. So the air, the glass, the water, and this clear plastic are all examples of mediums that light travels through. But something interesting happens when light travels from one medium to another medium. Here you can see that as light goes from the air into the clear plastic block, it bends. It bends again when it goes from the block back into the air. Light bends as it travels from one medium to another medium. And we call this bending of light refraction. Here you can see a red laser shining into an aquarium full of water. You can clearly see the light bend as it travels from one medium to another. The light refracts as it goes from the air into the water. The refraction of light is what makes objects that are placed into cups of water look bent or broken. The bending of light can be very useful. Lenses are used to refract light in useful ways. Lenses can be used to focus light. Or lenses can be used to magnify an image to make things that are small or far away easier to see. The different colors of light bend different amounts as they travel from one medium to another. Prisms are designed to bend light in a way that separates the colors to make them all visible. Rainbows actually appear when light travels between the air and tiny droplets of water. The light is refracted as it travels from one medium to another. This causes the colors to spread apart, creating a rainbow. So here I have a laser and three plastic toy dinosaurs that are all different colors. But when I turn the laser on, the laser beams only shine on the blue dinosaur. So here's your question. How could we use refraction to make a laser beam shine on each of the three dinosaurs? Take a minute and discuss that with your classmates. Then I'll be back to talk about the answer. Light refracts as it travels from one medium to another and lenses are used to refract light in useful ways. So by placing a lens in the path of the lasers, I can bend the light so that a beam of light from the laser strikes each of the dinosaurs. I'm sure this is what you and your classmates came up with, and I hope this video has helped you understand refraction a little bit better. Keep up the great work, and I'll see you next time. Uh -huh.